let's start I have here this is one fourth kilo of pork belly that I cut into strips Yun. so we're going to put this on a pan with no oil okay with no oil and we're just going to lay this together and flatten natin ng konti air and so that the pork will become tender we're going to add this is one third cup of water okay yeah so we're going to let this boil and simmer for a few minutes until the water evaporates yeah. when we're going to cover this now after a few minutes the water has already evaporated and we're now going to cook the pork in its own fat so again we're not going to put any oil but we're going to brown this on its own Ayan. so just continue to to stir your pork until it becomes caramelized or until it becomes brown as you can see now that the color of the pork is already brown and I think the process of this is called rendering rendering the pork as you can see there's a small pool of oil at the bottom Ito yung galing sa pork ko eh, because the pork belly has fats. Ayun. So, flavor lahat yan. Now, we're ready to add our next ingredient. I now have here with me four cloves of garlic chopped. Ayan. So, add na natin siya. Okay, and we'll just mix this. Isala natin siya. Pork pa lang, guys. Mabango na. <laughs> Ang bango na dito sa kitchen. Okay. And then, we're going to add, this is a uh, one onion slice. Ayan. So, isa-isa lang natin. Mmm, smells so good. Now, add our next ingredient. And this is one uh, fourth kilo of chicken liver. And so we're going to add this. And, and we're going to cook this until it changes color. Yeah, pag medyo wala ni mga dugu dugu niya. We're now going to add one teaspoon of pepper. Okay, nakakatakam na siya. And then, we're going to add, this is one-fourth cup of soy sauce. Ayan, so mga pampalasa na to. Okay. Next, we add, this is one medium size of carrot cut into strips. As you can see, the strips are not that thin, just a little bit thicker. Okay, and then we will add one cup of string beans cut diagonally. Or in Tagalog, we call this sitaw. So, konti lang, huwag masyado marami. Yun. And then next, this is one bulb of Chinese cabbage. Or in Tagalog, this is the pechay bagyo. And we will only add the white part. Yung green part niya later on yun. Since this is uh, the tougher part. Yun. And then next is one red and green bell pepper cut into strips. As you can see, very colorful na yung ating dish and I love it very much. Yun. And then, after stir frying the veggies, okay, and it's a little bit half cooked lang siya, no? Not too much cooked. We will set this aside. Ayan. So we will put this on a container. And, and this pan, we will still use this. Uh, this is very flavorful. Uh, all the ingredients were there earlier. We will add now two and a half cups of water. 
So we will wait for this to boil and at this point I have to apologize because nasira yung video when I added one piece of pork cube and two tablespoons of brown sugar. So yan yung pinapakulo ko sa water. Okay, so now it is uh, boiling and we're now ready to add 500 grams of Mickey noodles. Ayan. So, for pansit chami, this is the preferred type of noodle. Yeah, so we're just going to boil this and uh, cook, of course, the noodles. And while we are waiting this to boil, we're going to add 3 tablespoons of oyster sauce. Yeah, so mix mix lang natin siya until it boils. And now, we're going to bring back all the vegetables that we stir fry a while ago. Ayan, yung ating mga sahog. Ayan, so very festive yung colors. Uh, very appetizing. And at this point, uh, nagugutom na talaga ako. I, I got really hungry while I'm doing this dish. Ayan, as you can see, very uh, saucy yung ating pancit. And this is not yet the end of the video, okay? Okay, there's more that we will add to this pancit chami. It's really very special. Okay, as you can see, it's boiling very nicely. And now we're going to add this is our cornstarch slurry, which consists of one tablespoon cornstarch plus four tablespoon of water. Yeah, so, it dissolve natin siya and we will put this there. Ayan. So, bagya lang kumapal yung ating sauce but it's not that thick, okay? So, yun yung kagandahan dito. It's still very saucy. Ayan, yung kanyang sauce, it's still there. And now, we're going to add yung green part ng ating Chinese cabbage or yung pechay bagyo. Ayan, so we're going to add this. So very nutritious ang ating uh, pancit chami. There's so many vegetables in different colors. It's really very nice. And did you know that vegetables, of course, uh, balances the um, saltiness of our dish. So salty, tas may pagkasweet ang ating vegetables. So nagko-complement lang siya. As you can see, we added some quail eggs or pogo eggs, yeah, which is my favorite ingredient. So, gusto gusto ko talaga ang pogo eggs or quail eggs. Ayan. So, yeah, yan na yung ating finished product. Our pancit chami. I hope you will try this at your home. It is really very delicious. I guarantee you. Thank you.